Hi everyone, this is Yami Kim. And today I will uh, deploy CSS 1KV for NAT uh, from the scratch. So, so first thing I will deploy one CSS 1KV for NAT. So the other CSS 1KV deploy as PC for the ping test. So. Even though there is a two CSS one KV, actually, a uh, NAT will be done by just one CSS one KV. Okay, this is very simple topologies. So, uh, I will make uh, the new uh, VPC with name CSS one KV. So, CID block is the same, ten dot sixteen as the B class, and public IP address is here. Here is 10.16.0 and there will be two private subnet. One is 10.16.4, the other is 10.16.6 and two route. The one is public, one is private. And for the CSS 1KV, I will use the verb, 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 virtual routing forwarding uh, for the management. Actually, the management traffic will be through, through this way and the other traffic will go this way. Okay? So from the bottom, I will make, uh, my make the, this one. So, uh, same as the last time. So there are two tabs. One is the VPC, the other is EC2. I will make create VPC. So CSR1KB. Plug is 10.16.0.0 16-bit Okay? Oh, sorry There is one more dot um, I will make a subnet The subnet is... Uh, it's public Public 10.16.0 So John is A and uh, block is 10.16 24-bit um, I will make uh, another 2 uh, private 10.16.4.0 alright that 24 All right. Hmm. Anyway, I make another one. Six dot zero is private. Uh, it's a great. Uh, let's see. Everything is a or b. A. A A I'll make uh, two routing tables there is uh, something is over there let's call it public and let's make a private thing private actually uh, this is this is public, this is private. As I told you, as I told you, as I told you, this is actually L3 router. So this will have a routing table. Okay, and for the public, uh, we have the internet gateways. But there, uh, HW for uh, CSL 1KV VPC create, uh, then actions attach VPC here, it's attach it, and we have three subnet for the routing table at the public. We have to make a route for the internet. 
you should go to internet gateways here and for the subnet associate for the private we will make two subnet associate six and four here this private attaches two things save for the routing table I will make it later for the security groups I will make a security group one is SSH and ICMP no 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 ICMP don't try to change it add rules uh, SSH from sources anywhere in the network and ICMP is from the anywhere in the network okay and for the other security group is for the permit any any oh my god this is SSH ICMP and another the group is permit any for the internal traffic um, all, all traffic or traffic from internet is okay all right so from now now on I will deploy this one CSR 1kv1 uh, instances launch and from here we can search CSR 1kv and in the, the AWS marketplace and I will use BYO max performances because it's free I mean no licenses very limited like a 1 megabps like that anyway so I will use T3 medium because it must cheap here T3 medium and next here network is VPC oh my god what's wrong <laughs> I didn't make it on Seoul some reason but here here is Tokyo so I will change to Seoul sorry about that I'll start again CS1 can be maximum and next and T3 medium next then 1kb and this is public and IP address is I will give 10.16.0.10 and edit add interface and 10.16.4.11 right next and here next next security group is AGST1 and uh, ICMP is and launch the key is already I have the YAME so I will launch instances during instances launch I will give elastic IPs Elastic IP is oh, oh my god. Actually there are two network interfaces, right? Two network interfaces. Two network interfaces. Uh, we have to this is public. CSR1 public and CSR1 private and right and I can change I sent it okay but for this one I will change the security groups and and permit then is added okay right the elastic IPs are given 
allocate this one and associate with CSL 1KV public right then here instances it's CSL1 it's running and it has public IP addresses it's 15 blah 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 so I will <laughs> edit the shell script to connect hmm you take them sometimes a time in the time and simon let's ping this one I think it is time all oh, right it's working whose name is yes sir one all right and I will give a uh, IP address address it take a, a few seconds 10.6.4.10 and if we ping to the gateway after three or four, five seconds later, it's okay. Uh, the connection is connected <laughs> automatically. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh my God, what's wrong? Ah, I think interfaces, network interfaces. Mm, I did I attach attach it hmm and private is private is <gasps> oh my god I did a mistake it's for that eleven IP address 10.16 Sorry, it's my mistake Okay, it worked So, both of IP should be matched in AWS Okay uh, Alright, so I just make uh, Two, I mean, just one the CS1 QB I call the CSR one. So from now on, I will deploy this one CSR PC. The same. Go to instances and launch CSR and this one the maximum and continue. Then choose T3 medium. Then says one can be and the public. Then I should uh, let's see that twenty. That twenty. Right next. Same. Okay, it's uh, existing ones SSH. Then lunch and already we have pairs. Okay, during lunching, so I will give the one uh, elastic IP over there. This is for CSL one, right? Uh, 
uh, this is for CSR2, uh, CSR PC. All right, I will associate with CSL this one. So this is, oh my god. All right, and let's go to the network interfaces to give a name here. CSR PC, CSR PC public. So mm, let's connect the PC. All right. So what is PC IP address? This one. Uh, for the so for the key pairs, I did it at the last time. And please see last time my session. Uh, YouTube then you can check so how to do it at Linux and Mac with using chmod and with 400 and for the Windows you can use the putty PUTTY using some process and you can check the YouTube on the YouTube and the blog or some internet hmm It looks like working. Oh, all right. Yes. What's wrong? What's wrong? Why have to <laughs> give the password? Oh, I'm sorry. Actually, uh, Ubuntu is Ubuntu, but the uh, uh, it's the username is the easy to user. So I will change it. Sorry. And so, all right. This is CSR PC. Host name is CSR PC. All right. Okay, uh, for the PC, I will give uh, another interface to, to access this net network. Interfaces, create, uh, CSR, PC, CSR, PC, private, 7 is 60. This one, and custom IP address is 10.16. Six dot twenty or twenty. Twenty and uh, any. This will be permit any and create. After create, we must give a name. PC. And then we have to associate, attach to PC. CSR, what's wrong? CSR, this one, CSR PC, right? So let's check. This is a PC, show it. Okay, it's working. Okay, it's working. Then let's make a routing table because this is piece uh, here. 
So we have to give a routing table to access this network. All right. So I root. Same. So I have to give a network. What's wrong? Maybe I if I change to eleven, it will work. Okay, okay. So I will to use telet. I will change this one to input all. And I will make a username and password. Username Cisco privilege fifteen password Cisco. So from here, I can tell out to that. All right. And from now on, I will do the some kind of buff, buff working. Where is the buff? All right. Here, here is buff is. Measurement and I put work and I will change interface G one as birth forwarding MGMT. If I do that, connection lost because and I change the buff IP address is lost. Uh, IP address is 10.16.0.20 and then I can use this Again, right from outside, from my PC, I'm working. Oh my God! So you're working right now, and uh, let's see. Uh, let's give a uh, outside IP address. No problem because here and uh, non verb the uh, except the MGMT there is no default gateways. So it's right. It should be work? No, it doesn't work. Because no nut was configured. And also there is something wrong. So okay. So let's <laughs> let's configure that. Uh, all right, G1. Uh, this is PC. Oh, this is PC. Inter show wrong interface G1. Uh, what I'm doing is at CSR1, I will configure the NAT. 44 G2 is inside but not no computer over there so I put not inside and access list like that Did it work or not? Okay, working okay. and uh, this is all right. And after that, if I do ping, it doesn't work because uh, we should check about a narrow interface 
and about um, security check cause because this is about with this is enabled within the VPC it should working so if I want to traffic go to outside so interface should be uh, security check disabled oh my god what's wrong What's wrong? Uh, let's test about that. Uh, ping. It's working. And source. It's working. So. It looks working. What's wrong? Let's check. GitHub 2 is here. And default gateway is 16.1 is over there. And ACL. No, 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 I see. Mm, got it. As I just told you, this is L3 router, but this has no routing information for the internet. So we should uh, configure this one. So, route table private route and for the internet. This is the internet. We have to the narrow interface of CSR one private save. Oh my god. Uh, this we have this is associated a routing table is CSL one uh, private for the 11 everything looks right and uh, the NIC interfaces every NIC has this is force force First, first, anyway. So it should work. What's wrong? Mm, birth issues, is it? Uh, 
let me check. G mm, one is another pop, and this is default pop. And we are uh, routing table is only two. Ah, sorry, I have to remove this one. I don't need it. This is actual routing table. So if I ping to outside, it's working. And here I can check the routing and uh, not tables. So uh, right now, so everything is working fine. So I installed two CSRs. One is for the as a not router and one is for the just test PC here and uh, internal gateway is installed and there are two routes public and private and as I told you this is actual A3 switch and you have to configure these ones the routing tables and each subnet you have to set up and each NIC the narrow interface we have also you have to check so okay let's see one by one at the VPC so we have the VPC called CSR1KB and subnet we have three subnet 16.0 for the public and the 16.4 is private and 16.6 is uh, private Actually, every subnet belong, belong to just same like uh, the AZ availability zones. And for the routing table, I set up. Actually, for the public, sorry, for the public, I give a, a, a default internal routing table to the internet gateway. And for the private, also I give a default gate, internet gateway to here to CSL one. It's the gigabit to private the neural interfaces. Also, I associate two uh, subnet here. And for the elastic IPs, I have two elastic IPs, and uh, one is for CSR1, one is for CSR PC2, each associate with the right public IP addresses, but actually it's fake public IP addresses. And for the EC2, uh, instances I have two. Oh, I can change the name CSR PC. Uh, it's uh, working right now. And this PC is uh, security groups for the outside. I use so this one SSH and the ICMP uh, for the internal. I mean, internal means for the internal interfaces. I did give permit any. And for the KPRs, I did use called YAML2. And for the narrow interfaces, it's made and attached to the right devices. And one thing you have to don't forget is uh, interface is like a source desk to check first. If you enable this one, you have to use it within the same network. You cannot use outside of the VPC, I mean, internet. So uh, I did set up as a forest so everything is working fine right now and uh, just one thing this PC is CSR PC CSR 1KV is used as PC so uh, it uh, gigabit zero was above called MGMT for the public access the measurement and this interface is used and this is this one can be and very Confidence is very simple. Let's see one by one. Uh, first, I did give a host name, and this is outside, and this is inside, and this is for the NAT, and this inter this access list for the NAT, like a check. And also, I did give just a few routing tables here and here. So, if you know each family with network. It's very simple. This is Amikim, and next time I will deploy one more CSR on KV for the redundancy called HA3.
Thank you.